guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm Amelia Kate, if you're new here. So today I'm showing you vegan sweet treats for stocking fillers. So if you're vegan or know someone that's vegan and you're struggling to find little bits and bobs here and there for stocking fillers, then take some tips from this video because I went around every local supermarket to find what new vegan sweet treats that they had. I went to Tesco, Morrison's, Iceland, Sainsbury's and Asda. Not gonna lie to you, there was one particular supermarket that that was 10 times better than the rest um, for vegan things but I have seen other people find different things in supermarkets that I didn't actually find so depends on the area I think but we'll just get into the video now so I'll start off with Tesco so I got these cranberry and orange flapjack slices um, they don't look very festive, but I feel like the flavours are very Christmassy. Like, this isn't new or anything. Um, pretty sure this has been around a while. But um, I got this orange and almond green and blacks chocolate. Just because I've... Basically, before I was vegan, I used to love Terry's chocolate orange. And I'm always buying chocolate orange vegan alternatives. And um, I saw a post on Facebook the other day. Um, someone was asking basically the same thing. And this came up in the suggestion. So I thought I'd get this and give it a go. And it was actually on a deal as well. So pretty good. And another chocolate I got was just some uh, dark chocolate mint. It says on the back that it's suitable for vegetarians, but not. it doesn't say vegan, but all of the ingredients look vegan to me, so. Yep, so that was that. And the final thing I got from Tesco was these fruit slices. So they basically look like Christmas pudding, but just in like a little bar. Not Christmas pudding, Christmas cake. Christmas cake, not Christmas pudding. Christmas cake, but in a little bar. Um, I don't actually know if I like Christmas cake. I don't think I've ever had it. But I feel like this is pretty cool because a lot of them aren't actually vegan or suitable for vegans. And this one actually has the little logo at the bottom as well. So. Okay, so moving on to Morrison's, I only managed to find one thing in Morrison's um, and that was these after dinner mints, so basically after eights but suitable for vegans. Um, I have seen a lot of other people go to Morrison's and come out with massive vegan hauls but in my local Morrison's, this was the only vegan item that I found that was relative to the festive season. So, everyone loves after rates around Christmas time. I surely do. But yeah. Okay, and now we have Sainsbury's. So I picked up these chocolate and raisin cornflake clusters in Sainsbury's. Um, they're not very festive, but they were new, so I just had to get them anyway. And obviously they're perfect like size to fit in a stocking as well. And another thing that I got, which I've had before, and they're not new, they've been doing these for ages, but just white chocolate buttons and milk chocolate buttons um, 
and again perfect size for stockings and finally from Sainsbury's I picked up these um, Tiffin Belgian chocolate Tiffin things squares I have actually opened this and tried one just because I've never had a Tiffin before so I had no idea what it was when I bought it and it is very rich and it to, for me personally is quite sickly but yeah if Tiffin or those rocky roads you get is something that you like then Sainsbury's are doing doing little boxes of them they also had different flavours as well they had oh they, they also had they also had a selection box of Tiffins and they had just plain Tiffin which is these ones that I got uh, they had Rocky Road and Cranberry and Orange flavoured I believe um, don't quote me on that but they had some sort of other flavour that was similar to that but it was just it was just quite a big box that I didn't feel was relevant to this video for a stocking filler so anyway yeah Sainsbury's have that so something I picked up from Iceland was these coffee creams they also have mint creams um, I'm not sure if those are vegan because I didn't check it but these ones are vegan and I was just so excited when I saw these because I absolutely adore like coffee flavoured things and I have already tried them and they're so so good so and I feel like they look quite bougie and they were only like £1.15 in Iceland so I'd be really happy if I uh, took these out of my stocking <laughs> lastly I have Asda and Asda was the supermarket that I felt catered more for vegans this year for Christmas time um, well my local one anyway so we'll start off with, with these now I know they are quite large <laughs> and probably wouldn't fit into a stocking depending on how big your stocking is but they certainly wouldn't fit in my stocking so just an idea that if you are going to put these in someone's stocking then you could take them out of the box and like be a little bit extra and wrap them in foil or some like some coloured foil or some cling film or put them in like little sandwich bags or whatever I don't know um, but I just thought these were so so cute like they're little penguins they're little penguins like one is white chocolate obviously and one is chocolate and they're perfect for Christmas so or you could just gift this to someone and not have it as a stocking filler another thing from Asda was this chocolate orange bar now I have had this before and it's not new they've been doing it for a while but again I love chocolate orange around Christmas time because everyone gets their Terry's chocolate orange and yeah this is actually really really good um, and I've also got these chocolate orange buttons which are also really good and they taste very very similar to Terry's chocolate orange but another thing I picked up was this uh, Santa chocolate lolly cute for stockings also got Moo Free I, I really like this brand of chocolate um, my advent calendar is actually Moo Free and it's, it's so good um, but they do a range of these in like um, Santa and like snowmen so Asda I also have a chocolate selection chocolate selection box um, 
it does have the chocolate orange buttons and the chocolate orange bar in here so if you're looking for those then you could just get this and get more but obviously again this is quite large to fit into a stocking so this could be gifted to someone or you could take them out of the box and pop them in the stocking I've also got these cinnamon tortilla rolls now I'm not sure how I feel about tortillas with a cinnamon flavour but you could just pop them out into a bowl for like a Christmas party I think that would work quite well um, and I haven't actually seen these before I don't know if they're new it says new okay <laughs> so these are actually new <laughs> and I haven't seen them before obviously so I thought I'd buy them and give them a shot so also got these chocolate rocky roads I imagine they're going to be quite similar to the tiffins that I got from Sainsbury's but I just thought it was cool that they do like vegan vegan marshmallows on them which you don't really see often so I've got coconut and raspberry flapjack slices I don't know if this is festive I'm not really sure if this is festive but I just haven't seen them so I had to get them to give them a shot could make it festive, it's fine now I absolutely love gingerbread or ginger flavoured things ginger flavoured biscuits so I've got these ginger stem cookies and it says golden oat crunch with a ginger kick they sound really good actually but yeah I've got these chocolate coated raisins and chocolate covered crunchy bites I've had the raisins before and they are so 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 good I absolutely love these chocolate covered raisins but I haven't had these before but I imagine they might taste like mini little crunchy bites basically what it says on the packet <laughs> um, but yeah I feel like these are quite cute for stockings or just to have out in a bowl again for like a little party if people actually do Christmas parties anymore I've got this cracker selection again it's a bit large for stocking but it is very Christmassy I love a good cracker and some cheese around Christmas time and these have four different flavours they have a plain one, a cheese a rosemary and a salt and pepper one so I'm very excited to try these and um, they also have the, the the vegan logo and now we have something a little bit bougie I did like a shoulder like bougie um, and these are truffles and they have four different flavours including salted caramel, vanilla, dark orange and strawberry now I just, to be honest, I just really like the look of the box and the foil colours and I just really like the look of it so I feel like it might be too big to fit in a stocking but it would make a perfect gift anyway I've got chocolate coins and I've also got white chocolate coins now I know that you can get both of these from Sainsbury's as well not just from Asda and finally this is the last thing in this video I got chocolate truffles but like <laughs> they're in the shape of like sprouts, the mini sprouts which I thought was cute, I don't like sprouts but I do indeed like chocolate truffles so got those I got majority of the items in this video um, to put into 
a my own selection box so obviously they as far as I'm aware they don't do like a vegan quality street so I decided this year to make my own one so with things like this I'm just gonna pop them in and then have my own little box of quality street I also made Jess one not a vegan one but I made Jess one as well because I'm a bit extra and like I'm just the best girlfriend really but yeah no we just both have our own little mini tubs of chocolate to dip into when we're watching a movie or watching some tv or just chilling so that's another another idea if you needed any more ideas from this video but anyway yes yeah, so we've come to the end of this video it was quite a lengthy video um but I hope you've taken something away with you and some ideas or inspiration from different supermarkets. So if you enjoyed this video, please, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a big thumbs up. And also turn on notifications um, for videos that will be coming soon. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.